welcome back to the final part of our course on digital footprints and cyber security. We have already co covered the basics of digital footprints, their types, implications and advanced protection measures. Now, in this section, we will focus on practical strategies to protect your digital footprint and ensure robust cyber security. Before we delve into the strategies, have you ever experienced a cyber security incident that made you realize the importance of actively safeguarding your digital presence? To protect your digital footprint, you need to start with solid online privacy practices. Let's explore some key strategies. Are you currently mindful of your online privacy practices? Have you ever made changes to your habits to enhance your digital privacy? Periodically review and adjust the privacy settings on your social media accounts. Limit the amount of personal information that's visible to the public. When was the last time you reviewed your social media privacy settings? What challenges, if any, do you face when trying to manage your online privacy? Utilize encrypted messaging apps and email services for sensitive communications. Encryption ensures that only intended recipients can access your messages. Do you currently use encrypted messaging apps or email services for confidential conversations? How comfortable are you with the level of encryption in your digital communications? Be selective about the information you share online. Only provide necessary details when signing up for services or making online purchases. Are you cautious about sharing personal information online or do you tend to provide more than required? What motivates your decision in these situations? Password and account security are fundamental aspects of protecting your digital footprints. Let's delve into effective strategies. How confident are you in the strength of your passwords? Have you ever experienced a security breach related to weak passwords? Use strong, unique passwords for your online accounts. Avoid using easily guessable information like birthdays or common words. Do you currently use a password manager to generate and store passwords? What challenges, if any, do you face when managing your passwords? Enable two-factor authentication wherever possible. This adds an extra layer of security by requiring a second verification step such as a code sent to your phone. Have you ever experienced the benefits of two-factor authentication? How do you feel about the extra steps required to enhance security? Change your passwords periodically, especially for critical accounts. This reduces the risk of unauthorized access. Do you have a routine for changing passwords or do you rely on two-factor authentication and strong passwords to secure your accounts? Education and awareness are potent tools in the realm of digital security. Let's explore strategies for staying informed. How do you stay informed about cybersecurity best practices and emerging threats? Have you ever been a part of cybersecurity awareness training? Keep up to date with the latest cybersecurity trends, threats, and best practices through reputable sources, blogs, and news outlets. What sources or channels do you trust for reliable cybersecurity information? Have you ever encountered misinformation related to cybersecurity? Consider participating in cybersecurity awareness training programs either individually or through your workplace or educational institution. Have you ever undergone cybersecurity training? How did it impact your understanding and approach to online security? Share your knowledge with friends, family, and colleagues to create a more informed and secure digital environment. Do you currently share cybersecurity tips and knowledge with others in your network? Have you encountered situations where your insights helped someone to protect themselves online? As we conclude this course on digital footprints in cybersecurity, it's essential to remember that your online presence is an asset that requires careful protection. We have covered many topics from understanding digital footprints to practical strategies for safeguarding your digital identity. Now that you have gained insights into protecting your digital footprint and enhancing your cybersecurity, what specific actions do you plan to take secure to take to secure your online presence better? Thank you for being part of this educational journey. By implementing the strategies and knowledge gained here, 
your proactive steps towards a safer, more secure digital future. Stay vigilant, stay informed, and stay safe in the ever-evolving landscape of digital footprints in cybersecurity.